harmony, soil, gut microbes, and human health. Our gut microbes depend on soil microbes. Soil contains both good and bad microbes. Aerobic soil has a very small percentage of bad microbes, while anaerobic soil has predominantly bad microbes. The beneficial microbes in soil contribute a balanced amount of nutrients to our food. When we consume this healthy food, it supports the growth of beneficial gut microbes, which send positive signals to the brain. However, consuming unhealthy food allows harmful microbes to dominate, leading to cravings for sweets and other unhealthy choices. Humans are biological, chemically driven electric machines. We live in a symbiotic relationship with all the other living life forms in the world. Humans are made out of 100 trillion living things. 37.2 trillion are human cells and the rest 63 trillion are the bacteria and other organisms that live inside our guts, or what we call our biota. They weigh almost 4.5 kilograms in weight. They not only digest most of our food but they are 70% of our immune system without which we can't survive any infection or disease. We know almost 50,000 different probacteria and are finding new ones daily. The food of these bacteria is the plants we eat, especially fiber. The plant's health and diversity determine the health of these 63 trillion bacteria. If you do not feed our biota with nutrient-dense and diverse plants then their population will slowly start to die and your health will be destroyed. Thus you may even age two biological years in one chronological year. No wonder some will live at 65 while others may live a 100. Yes God shows us the path or not. We also live in sync with the sun. The human brain, the pineal gland, tracks the movement of the sun and then the internal clock derives the hormonal patterns through the nervous system that is controlled by the cerebellum and the pituitary glands. All our functions from the insulin cycle, melatonin cycle, or cortisol cycle are dependent on our gut slash biota health and circadian rhythm. The fundamental pillars of health are nutritionally dense natural foods without all known poisons, toxins, and antibiotics, right long sleep, high hydration, aerobic exercise, fasting. Your brain and physical health are dependent on all of the above. Soil that kills the plant biota kills our gut biota and kills our health and longevity as a consequence. In this intricate dance of microbes, sunlight, and soil, we find the essence of life, a symphony of interconnectedness that shapes our very existence.